Hello YouTube, here is a little vlog to let you know why there wasn't an episode of Dust today. As you've probably noticed, uh, there's been a lot of content going up my channel this week. Uh, from the Elder Scrolls beta to the Walking Dead Season 2 Episode 2 content. So... You know, normally I've been doing the dust episodes on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Or if there was an episode that had mostly cutscenes, I would have that go up on Thursday. And then I'd have a longer episode go up on Friday. But because of the, uh, you know, like I said, of the Walking Dead and Elder Scrolls, you guys have had a lot of content going up this week. So I'll give you guys some time to go ahead and catch up on that. Plus, uh, over at my friend Indima Pimp's channel, I've been working on his WWE 2K14 YouTuber tournament. He just posted up his trailer nine hours ago. Uh, you can see here's the uh, trailer right here. You can go ahead and watch it. I'll link it in the description, or of course you can just go right to his channel and check it out. Uh, instead of showing you the video here in YouTube, let me go ahead and close my browser and kabam! It's my video editor, and look, here is the entire match. Just to show you, here this part here with Markiplier and Danny. Let's go ahead and select the Markiplier and Danny and hide those, and bam, look, it's gone. So you can see right here, this is what I have. I've been working on this trailer for him. As you can see, there's a lot of layers going on. Pretty much right down here is the MV3 file. So it starts out with this video, let me pan up, that we have this right here, the, row, the ring pan up, which pretty much what this is, is just the ring where it just kind of pans up really slowly and that's it. And then on top of that I have it set to overlay these text layers here where it starts out with the this is, you know, not your typical King of the Ring tournament. Say a Pimp and Dima Pimp presents WWE YouTuber tournament. You can see here's just the fire overlay I was using. And then we go ahead and cut here. We show I have this uh, versus thing. Is if I bring up the position, you can see all the position sliders where I have it set to. You can see right here where it's there on the left. And then you'll see it like right here. And then it slides over into place. And then we'll go here and then right here at the end, I have it set where it goes from the middle all the way over here to the right and then right here I've set where it goes back, back, back to the left and that swings back over to the middle right as the next person comes out so they introduce you know all the people then after that I have it set here where it goes now to the trailer text which pretty much I have this set as an extra layer separate layer where pretty much it has you know there let me go ahead and just scroll down and tell it just to RAM preview this. Where pretty much it's just displaying all the text by itself with no extra, you know, video in the background. see there we go that's the you other know, just that video there that I have I created all that if you're wondering what this is based off of uh, I guess I looks like I hit it out of this channel but go and go back to the trailer you'll see here I have it where it uses all of these video clips from I'm just going to unhide all these all of these video clips where it shows you know a clip from the Markiplier versus Danny match and then it goes to a peanut butter gamer versus pro Jarrett match and here it uses a little bit from the Paul versus Dom and then I have right here where it uses a little bit of the Jontron versus Dom 
and then and uses another cut from that same match. And here's one from Nick and Ross. Here's one from Eagle Raptor and the Completionist. Here's one from Graham and Josh. The beginning of it, and then Yahtzee versus Barry with a thing, and then cuts right there, right down here to the Photoshop file of just showing, you know, everyone who is in the tournament. Where I have that set up, as you can see with all these positions, scale and opacity sliders, I have them set where it just kind of slowly pans it in. And there's the end of it. So, I have been working on that, but next thing I've been working on is this right here. This is what I've been working on. The entire Markiplier versus Danny match. This has probably took me, I don't know how many hours. But you'll see, uh, here's the match. I have it set up where I have a bunch of different things. We have this right here, the punch out thing, where I pretty much took Danny's uh, video. I think it's Danny. Yeah, I took Danny. And I created this right here. Let me go ahead and go full screen and tell it to a RAM preview. I created this. And you'll hear sound effects as well. As soon as it decides to play it. Okay, let's try clicking. Did it do weird? What is your problem, computer? Let's do this then from beginning to end. Ram preview that. You can kind of see there I have the, uh, the, you know, the yellow glow with a bunch of the boom glows. Let's see, go back to the actual video itself where you can see exactly where this happened. Kind of give you a sneak peek of what's going on with this match. Also, if you want to see this and see what to expect, let me go and ram preview this. We see him here. He grabs him, picks him up, and then here he's going to start doing his finisher. We'll see him do punch, boom, stars come, boom, match, finisher, punch. You should see a little bit of glow here in the face. Bam! And then, bam and air glow. And now it should start the stars again. And you'll still see there is a little bit of glowing going on every time he gets punched in the face. And now it should do it as his finisher. You'll see him like uppercut. And then you'll see him do a little wind up. And then we get all the little uh, blue uh, stars coming in, and then kaboom! And now that you saw what it looks like as it renders it, let's go ahead and play it real time. Oh no! Wait a minute, Cole, what's he gonna do here? I think he's So, I've been working on cool effects like that. Because you can see right here, if I take this entire project and hide th just hide this layer here, this, uh, sorry, punch out one, you'll see that entire thing that I just showed you. Look, there's a the whole thing with no effects applied. And then I have the same thing happens here again. And then we have random uh, exploits from audio and stuff so yeah make sure you go ahead and wait for this episode to come out it should be coming as soon as i get them all done i have quite a bit of matches to actually work on let's go ahead and just say oh it's fine and the actual match and just say open and explore so you'll see here here's the video files i have for this archive on my pc so we're right now we're in the preliminary preliminary blah whatever the word is whatever this word here is the first set of matches we will see here hey look I wonder where this video here showing all the matches came from 
Uh, hmm, maybe that little recording there. So yeah, we have... Or I wonder what this video right here that shows the camera panning up, you know. Yeah, so that, that's what that was. And then you'll see here, here's all the matches for the preliminaries. We get them with this, and then we go next to the quarterfinals. And then we go to the semifinals. And then we go to the fi you know, finals. And the thing about the title matches and stuff, I'm not going to let you load the preview so you can see who the winner is. But yeah, make sure you go ahead and watch Indima Pimp's channel. I'm going to see if I can multi-release it onto my channel since I am doing a lot of the video editing. So that way it will be kind of a joint thing since, you know, he spent the time to create the characters, create their theme song, create their move set, and record all the matches. But I spent the time to render the videos upload the videos, add these special effects and stuff that he wants, and, you know, that way, uh, you know, we kind of can both share in the video and stuff. So, uh, but this video has gone on for about 11 minutes, so hopefully you guys have stuck around. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and end this recording, and hopefully I will see you guys, you know, when I have some more time and not grinding on editing this for him. So, thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.